This is like uh, my favorite Stallone movie, one of his best in my opinion. Straight 80s action all the way. Love it. Hell yeah. Some badass gun. Bam. Cobra. <laughs> one of the best intros in movie history, period. I always said that uh, when a movie starts off at a grocery store or a liquor store or something like that in, eight, in any uh, 80s or 90s movie, some shit gonna go down. Hell, I wanted, yeah. Some help gonna be needed in a little bit. <laughs> the young couple arguing. And I'll be happy as hell when they see the news. That lady right there. Again, happy as hell when she watches the news. Yeah, had just left the store and then that shit went down. Move your ass. Don't do it, buddy. Don't do it. Shit. Bam. Not a fruit lover, huh? Oh, look at this poor cart. Fucking jumped in the air. Bam. Oh, yeah. Call the cobra. Don't run in the straight line. Move sideways. There you go. Damn, still didn't work. Uh, snowman waving goodbye. Aw, oh, shit. I love that car. If I was like a billionaire, that'd be, that'd be one of my first cars I'd buy. The Austin 50. 80s badass. I wouldn't be surprised if something like this happened in the near future. These Trump supporters are really mad. You could have took him out right there, man. Product placement. You know how much money Coors had to pay for him to drink that beer on screen? Look at that. A million bucks right there. I like all that, that little fog on the floor. Why is he still wearing shades? Go ahead. Go ahead. I don't shop here. I don't shop here. I don't deal with psychos. I ain't no psycho man. Well, yes, you are. <laughs> the multiple angles. You gotta love that. 80s shit. If it would have been one of those bombs where it's already pressed, and if the, the person lets it go, then it goes off. His whole plan would have got fucked up. Sorry, I like this part. Show him, man. Show him. You tell that to his family, huh? Damn right. West Coast. Oh, this, this is funny as hell. Bam. Now, this part doesn't really make a whole lot of sense because he rips his shirt off, right? And it exposes a wire he had on his chest, like he's snitching or something. But nobody does anything, nobody says anything. It's weird. It was either a, a mistake in the movie, or they're trying to say he's a snitch. Well, I'll check out underneath his white uh, wife beater. Pinche. Well, check, it, check it out. You see that? Look at that. He got a wire on this chest. What does that mean? Look, he's not even tripping off them looking at it either. He just read a headline. It's like, I don't like the whole paper. See that telescope in the back? It means he's either a perv or an astronomer. Well, here you go. He's gonna cut his pizza with a scissor. I don't get it. And it's cold. It's not like it's hot. You gotta bear in mind, he's Italian. So, that's like eating a pizza with a fork. How come criminals don't wear panties on their heads anymore? This is why you should mind your business. Don't look. Don't look. And she looks. There's a lot of statues up there. Uh-huh, she's a cop. 
Imagine how many psycho cops are in the force. In any force, any police department. Oh, that shit. Here comes the montage. It won't be an 80s movie without a montage. That means they drove by Skid Row, pointing a light at them and just recording without their permission. The guy from Sledgehammer. What's up with uh, Sylvester Stallone and robots? I think he had one in uh, Rocky. Was it four, I think? It's all right, I'll take it from here. You sure? No problem, our car's right over there. Okay. Well, you're in good hands. Good night. Sledgehammer trying to get his pimp on. I'd be sick not to want to sleep with you. Okay, then don't do it for me. Do it for your career. <laughs> Old school shit. Before me too. No, not the nerd. Oh, oh he was taking a, uh, his wife a gift or something. Or boyfriend. Move out of the way. You got all the time in the world. Come on. And no. Oh, the luckiest lady in the whole movie. Come on, elevator. Hurry up. This is a cool movie because usually the black people die in the movies in the 80s first. Here come The Shining in one, two, three, four, and five. Or six. Or seven. There you go. The Shining, man. Damn. How many times have, that, have, that, have they done that in other movies? Where the hell were y'all at, man? What is this, a goddamn game? You didn't say the magic word. I like the uh, old school captains who always Jeez. scream their head off. If you notice, this movie's like non-stop action, man. That's why I like the fact that it's only an hour and a half. I don't like when they stretch it out and it gets boring and it slows down. Fuck all that. If you're gonna stretch it out, hella, hold on. Damn. See what I'm saying? Oh, no, not the 50. Ooh, shit. Nothing like an 80s car chase. Man, the best, bar none. I love this part. Bam, bam, bam. Woo, shit. Hell yeah. Watch out, Santa. Nah, oh, this shit's crazy right here. No CGI, real shit. Woo, look at that. Bam, fucking stuntman back then, man. My hat's off, for real. Why doesn't he just clear the whole damn glass? Watch out, here go the nitro. Bam! Gone. Drop. Oh, this is a good one. It's a good shot. All the little hopping the car does. Right there. <laughs> That's fucking cool. Look at that shit. Bam! Fireworks. Oh, shit! No, not the 50. God damn it. It'll cost a fortune to restore that car. As a kid, I always thought right here, those were his teeth. War time. <laughs> that motherfucker was doing a ballerina leap. Weird science all over again. Oh, shit. Fucking stuntman, man. Back then, shit. Never see the two amaze me. Fuck. He could have shot the driver, but all right. When I tell you how much Mexicans love this movie, shit. We love it. Go through it. Boom. Goodbye, hood. What? Still there? That would be funny if he just got an orange and started eating it. Now, you know what? If you think about it, this is probably where uh, Terminator 2 got it from. Looks like the exact same factory. 
There's just fire coming out of everywhere for no reason. How the hell did he know that a valve did that? Oh, ho, ho. Bam. I love this beach. We are the hunters. We kill the weak so the strong survive. You can't stop when they will. Your filthy society will never get rid of people like us. That's right. We are the future! No. Imagine if a president gave that speech at his inauguration. You won't do a pig. 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 This, this is where the law stops. stops. And I uh, start. <laughs> that bitch is still alive. Never did like that bitch. Man, bam. Now those screams are pure agony. They get you anything? Yeah. I would kill for some. Gummy bears. And ten years later he was diabetic. No hard feelings. Nah, no hard feelings. Only that feeling of my fist between your face. Bam. Yep. No hard feelings. No hard feelings. <laughs> I love it. All right, this is how you end the movie, man. Right off into the sunset. One of the best 80s movies ever. My opinion, the best Sylvester Stallone movie. Non-stop action. You gotta love it. Fucking uh, the one-liners, comedy. I mean, it has everything. Shit, for real. But from one to ten, twelve. That's right. I love this fucking movie. I know almost every line, but I didn't want to do that and I didn't want to do that and have y'all get annoyed and shit. Only a little bit. But yeah, that's it for this video. As always, stay safe. Watch out for that Roman.